proud of the guys. I thought the guys really put a strong 120-minute effort in on the weekend, and they were great games. You take a look at the last four games against Bowling Green. We could be 0-4. We could be 4-0. We could be 2-2. Two two. I mean, there's just a small margin of error in these games, and we had a little puck luck, but we also played very well, and uh, I thought they were well-earned uh, well wins. We had a great third period, which I was very happy with the third period. The second period, the ice got tilted, which we knew. I mean, it's just a matter of time before they had a lot of push. They, they, they took over. They took over in the second period. We were chasing the game. We were shorthanded, but our guys responded well in the third. So just before we got out there, I told uh, Rosie, I said, just take a quick look up at the, the far blue line. I might get behind their defenseman. If it's not there, don't pass it. If it is there, then, you know, I'll be gone. And took a quick look, made a beautiful pass, and I was lucky enough to finish. We did what we had to do to win. We played simple. Nobody was selfish. Nobody played for themselves. We all played for the team. Uh, the coaches prepared us very well coming into these two games. And, um, yeah, that's that's basically it. Enjoy this uh, this weekend, and now we got to get ready for Lake Superior State, who, again, another team we've had unbelievable battles with over the course of the last couple of years. I think we got to stay focused. You know, we, we swept a, a really good Bowling Green team. But, I mean, they, they don't hand out trophies for sweeping the fifth-ranked team, right? So, you know, we, we got to stay focused. We will enjoy it tonight and, you know, get back to work on Monday and get ready for Lake State.